Handball to the Max. Oh yeah. Rule one, no face shots. Rule two, one step then you can't move. Rule three, if you drop the ball it goes to the other team. Oh yeah. Rule four, six players on the court at once per team. Rule five, don't hit the ball out of their hands. Rule six, you are allowed to hit the ball out of the air. Rule seven, if it goes out of bounds, it goes to the other team. Rule eight, you can only hold the ball for three seconds after you stop. Rule nine, if you stop, you can only pass it or shoot it. Rule 10, when a team scores, you reset in the middle of the court and the other team starts with the ball. Rule 11, at the start of the game, one team starts with the ball in the middle of the court. Every quarter, the possession changes to the other team. Rule 12, no swearing. Rule 13, no punching. Rule 14, when starting with possession, one pass before a shot. One of the many techniques of handball is passing. When you pass, there's four different types of passes. There's overhand, underhand, short passes, and long passes. It's important that you learn all these different types of passes so that you can react to different stages in the game. Shooting is how you score points. You want to shoot in the four corners of the net where the goalie is not, and you can have hard shots or low, soft so shots. Boo! You stink! Another great technique is defending, swatting the ball and stopping it from going into the goal. Communication is also a major part of handball. When you're making plays and asking for the ball when you're open, Communication is a major part of winning. Catching is the last technique. The way you catch is putting your hands into a diamond like this. And slowly pulling it back to your chest. First offensive strategy is getting open. What you need to do for getting open is you need to be constantly moving so that the other team can't block you from getting the ball. And this helps you to move forward so you're able to score. The next offensive strategy is pass run pass. This is using teamwork to advance the ball. Here's a demonstration. There are two different defensive strategies. The first one is man on man. This is when you stick to one man and only cover that one man, and your teammates also do the same. This creates not a lot of people on the opposing team that are open, so they can't score as well. The second defensive strategy is called zone. This is when you just guard the zone around your goalkeeper. This creates it so that it's a lot harder for the opposing team to shoot on goal. However, they are allowed available to advance uh, more quickly. Handball to the max.